I want to welcome everyone to this haircut tutorial. My name is Detail Dale, and in this haircut tutorial, we are going to execute a 2021 Nick Jonas fade haircut, followed up with a beard. Now, the first thing that we're going to do to get this started, we're going to, on the sides, use a number two Andis magnetic clipper attachment. And this attachment on these clippers, the blade will be set, pushed all the way up. The lever will be pushed all the way up. And we're going to start on the right side and we're going to work our way around to the left side. And we're not going to go all the way up. We're just going to go three quarters of the way up because the rest of the remaining hair, we're going to cut as short as we can with scissors. We're going to start on the left side and we're going to cut his hair at the left top all the way around to the right side top as short as we can with our fingers and as you can see I'm working my way around now I'm gonna jump over to the right side and just start cutting as short as I can with my fingers until I get everything done everything is, is at that length that we want now once that's completed we're going to cut on the top working from the front to the back using the very front as a guideline as you can see what I'm showing you and we're, we're going to cut vertically from the front all the way to the back of his crown from front to back and if you don't get all the hair the first time around, and you usually do working with these Mataki scissors because they're pretty precise, then you just go back and hit it again. And then we'll go to the right top side and we'll finish that horizontal cut, blending the top side into the top center working our way back which is what we're doing right now on the right side the right top side now once that right top is done we'll go over to the left top in the front and just cut horizontally going to the back so now that we got the top completed and we have the length that we want the foundational length on the side that we want with our number two attachment. Now what we're going to do is we're going to bring what we had cut at the very top sides with our fingers going as short as we can. We're going to bring that in to the number two by using the clipper overcomb method. And we're using our Andis Nation cordless NVLI fade clippers to blend out that number two into where we had cut with the scissors on the sides, top sides and in the back. So we're going to start the fading process by balding out at the very, very bottom using the Andis Outliners. And we're going to go as short as we can with our Andis Outliners followed up by our Andis Shavers to make it even baby smooth. So now that we have got the sides balled out and we also have used our Andis Nation Cordless NVLIFA clippers to go, I would say about half of an inch up above where we have balled it out at. Then we're gonna come back through with our Andis Cordless outliners and we're gonna knock that first line out which was created because we went up half inch with our Andis Nation Cordless NVLI fade clippers. So now we're knocking that line out with our Andis Cordless outliners. Starting on the left side, and you can see we're taking that line out. I'm using an Andis clipper brush. So we want to make sure that there is like no hair there that's already cut. So once we get that completed, I'll put on a zero attachment and again it's an Andis magnetic clipper attachment and I'll start from the right side and I'll go up another half inch all the way around and once we're completed with that I'll remove the attachment and just with these Andis Nation cordless NDLI fades I'll start blending out that line and I'll adjust the lever accordingly if 
there's more that needs to be taken off, I'll lift the, the lever up a little bit higher. But I'll be going back and forth. And I like the fluidness of using these Andes Nation cordless NVLI fade clippers. So, guess what? I finally got my Andes Master Cordless Limited Edition Go clippers charged up. So, I'm just nitpicking with them. Just knocking out this fade with them. Just This is my very, very first client I'm using these uh, Go Masters on. So, I'm excited. And I'll just put on my number one Andes Magnetic Clipper Attachment. And I'll just start knocking that fade out even more working all the way around just to make sure that fade is just right on point so once that's completed we'll start working on his beard using the Andis Slimline Pros under his chin to just put in that first knockdown of the hair just taking it down real good there we're setting in a line like a guideline there and I got my Andis copper gold foil shavers here to just make it real baby smooth under his chin. Now we're going to apply the lather because we're going to use the Mataki Suraizu straight razor. And this is where people get their money's worth with that hot towel as hot as they can stand to soften up those hairs so that you can use a straight razor to make sure everything is butter smooth. Plus you get to edge up his beard with it too for that real nice precision look you can't go wrong and using this uh, straight razor is a wonderful finisher around just edge ups and now I'm using I'm back to use my Andes Masters again these gold masters just to do the finishing touch look at that fade right there on the right side lovely Lovely. Joey know he's going to get lucky tonight. I can tell on his face with this crispy cut. You don't really have to talk too much because the haircut do all the talking for you. Just using a little bit of cleaning up right there with my, my Slimline Pros. And that's pretty much it. This is the 2021 Nick Jonas Fade Haircut with a beard. And I want to thank you for watching this video. And if you like it, you found it beneficial, please subscribe to this channel and hit that like button. Thanks again, friends. Take care.